Tungsten is an invaluable element in the alloying process where elements are blended to form new and improved metals known as alloys. Tungsten provides a unique contribution as it imbues exceptional strength, corrosion resistance and other useful properties to base metals. Besides being a great alloying element, tungsten can also be the base for its own alloys and this article will highlight the basic categories of these tungsten-based alloys. We will investigate the main categories of tungsten alloys, their beneficial properties and the applications for each type. The hope is that by learning about the different grades of tungsten alloys available, buyers will have an easier time choosing the right tungsten alloy for their projects. Tungsten alloys, sometimes referred to as heavy alloys, are usually 90-97% to tungsten, with the rest of its composition being a matrix of metals, which improve the ductility and machinability of the resulting alloy. There is no true naming standard for these alloys, as they are set individually by the manufacturer and are not superimposable onto a general scheme, such as with the alloys of steel or aluminium. Tungsten nickel iron alloys have a low expansion coefficient useful for glass to metal seals and possesses high moduli of elasticity, which makes them resistant to elastic deformation. These alloys are perfect for radiation shielding, so as its high density matched with its radiation resistance are ideal for protective components. Some notable applications include balance weights, security and defense applications, ballasts, bearing assemblies and more. The non-magnetic cousin to tungsten nickel iron alloys is the tungsten nickel copper alloys. They are about as popular as nickel iron alloys, but generally have lower tensile strength, 500 to 700 MPa, and ductility. They are not great electrical conductors and are easy to machine despite their higher mechanical strength. They possess excellent thermal stability and can shield from radiation about as well as other tungsten alloys. The greatest advantage to tungsten nickel copper alloys is their non-magnetic nature. This feature allows them to be used in applications where tungsten nickel iron alloys would be magnetically disruptive. They are widely specified in oncology tools, electrical sensor shields, guidance system components and military technology. Tungsten carbide is not a true alloy, but a ceramic-like compound made by using the sintering process where carbon black is added to tungsten powder and shaped to produce an extremely hard and brittle cement once cooled. Tungsten is used in certain alloys that are not covered by the previous sections. While not considered true tungsten alloys, they are the result of tungsten addition and are similar in both mechanical and chemical characteristics. Thanks for watching. Until next time.